Hey, hey, everybody. Musha the Scribe, sending all light, love, and healing energy to the celestial beings of the cosmos. Um, I'm going to entitle this video just my thoughts for today. All right, so I'm pretty sure y'all are probably aware of what went down at the Capitol, and uh, what's still going down at the Capitol. A whole, uh, whole lot of Trump-driven chaos, um, rioters all over the place. Um, they tearing the Capitol up. A lot of people have been arrested. One person has been murdered. Um, and news is still coming in on that. Uh, but that shit is a mess. And it's crazy because a friend and I was talking about it yesterday. Like, um, they're removing the lockdowns for right now. Um, the news are broadcasting that expectations of people taking the vaccine willingly are way lower, um, way lower than they, they first thought. Um, and that with it being like, okay, we had back to back holidays all throughout the fall. So it was easier for them to commence these lockdowns to things because of the Rona, because, you know, people traveling, people shopping, um, you have a, a lot of masses of different people, you know, out because it was holiday season for real. So it was easy to be like, Hey, we're going to lock down. The numbers are going up and shit. But we were saying how, look, there are no major holidays for a little bit right now something along the lines of somebody dying or a riot ensuing is going to have to happen within this little bit of time for there to be another lockdown or major event um along those lines things of that nature um we were just talking about this i want to say the night before last and then next thing you know here it goes <laughs> uh they didn't tore up the capitol that's, it could result in martial law. It could result in lockdowns. Uh, there's already curfews being placed in D.C. right now, you know, because of this shit. Seen that coming. Um, as well as, uh, it, I find it coincidental that when this happened, they started releasing news, like, right before that two of the officers involved in Breonna Taylor's murder uh, were fired from the force and everything. And uh, like clockwork, as soon as they release that news, here come the riots and protests and things in the Capitol, for real. Uh, so that's also part of the news. Go check that out. Uh, two of the police officers in the, involved in the murder of Breonna Taylor uh, were so-called fired or whatever. Um, and that could have been a psyop in itself. But now it's like they're running multiple psyops at one time. Um, you know, to still try to have people in fear and worry and low vibrational energies and shit, man. Um, so this will be a nice quick update. I just wanted to talk about that real fast. I'm still watching the news, keeping up with what's going on in D.C. right now. So go check both of those things out. Go check out the uh, Breonna Taylor officers and go check out what's happening in the Capitol. Shit is a mess. <laughs> man, love.